Hey everybody, Ian Carmel is with us today. Thank you so much for being of here. Of course, yeah, it's a pleasure to be. I was going to be at the Moda Center getting up shots anyway. So yeah, I'm just well, really glad you guys stopped we by. We interrupted your workout. Yeah, yeah. Sorry about that, man. <laughs> it's all right. It's yeah. all right. And with that, we're off with a KGW shoot you can't plan for. We'll get to those 37 footer attempts later. Ian Carmel, the guy who subtly tried to switch his name to Damien Carmel, note the hyphen, met us at the Moda Center today. We talked about keeping his Blazers super fandom alive while still working as head writer for The Late Late Show with James Corden. Big moment for us. That's him on the show two years ago, trying not to scare Damien Lillard. We were talking in the newsroom today. You are quite arguably the Blazers maybe most famous fan. I, I don't know about that. <laughs> Katie, there's Katie Lang you got to contend with. True. Portugal the man. But I am, I am definitely the Trailblazers, like, like chubbiest, most Jewish fan. I'll take that. Yeah. <laughs> like, has anyone else said that to you, or like, did no, you? No, no, no. That's just, that's just a, self, a radical self-analysis. Oh, thank God. Yeah. Okay. No. He may also be the best at throwing shade. After Dame sent the Thunder packing in Game Five with, yes, that shot, Carmel tweeted this photo of Damian Lillard holding his son and wrote, "Wow, Dame is walking OKC's Russell Westbrook back to the bus. What a sportsman." implying Westbrook is a baby. Today, he put that venom to work. Welcome back to clearly normal Blazers coverage. Mm -hmm. Calling fake highlights from the series. Our favorite, Paul George's meaningless dunk at the end of game three. All right, time winding down in the fourth quarter, and Paul George slam dunks the basketball. It's a beautiful dunk, but time had expired. A, a ultimately impressive, but in the long run, useless show of athleticism which kind of pairs well with the Thunder's entire season. But enough talk. Things got serious with Ian and I both trying to hit Damian Lillard's game-winning three. We both missed, but that didn't stop Carmel from nailing Dame's ice-cold stare into the camera from the Blazers' dog pile. Hard to tell who's who. Anything you want to say to Dame? Uh, I'm coming for you, you know? You better be training <laughs> hard this summer, because... I will sign a 10-day contract and just take that job right from you. Leave this team room championship, parades, sponsorship deals, you know. It'll be me and Kawhi on New Balance because I have sort of a wider foot. It's a wide foot. It's an issue, the foot width. <laughs> <coughs> You're really good at basketball. It's a long message. <laughs> I love that. It's an issue with the foot width. It's a foot width issue. All right. Our thanks, by the way, to Blazers and to the Blazers and to Ian. He did not have to do this. He was just home visiting family this week, and we basically reined him in for this special. So in return, if you could check out his work, we'd so appreciate it as a thank you. He has a Netflix stand-up special, and his podcast is hilarious. It's called All Fantasy Everything. Guys, this is a pretty good day. Fun we'll story. I, can't, I still can't believe you got on the court at the Motor Center. That's awesome. They're going to sign you both up before you know it. Right? Thank you, Maggie. That was, that was a lot of fun.